Hey friends, it's back with Beautiful Miss Plans. Um, I'm here to plan another week um, in my Hope and Two Weeks. This is going, like this size has been the absolute perfect size. I never thought that I would be, you know, like this size planner kind of person, but yeah, it's been working so well. So we're gonna plan for the first full week of August, so the 7th through the 13th. This is a big week because this is the week that my kids go back to school. That's kind of the big thing. Um, we have sneak a peek night, which they get to meet their teachers and then first day of school. So um, yeah, um, let me go ahead and roll my lines. So um, in the ever fun game that we've been playing every week, uh, today's movie for my kids is Oliver and Company. We do, um, so that's the background noise if you hear it. Oh my gosh. Um, we do one, two, three, four, five. during the pandemic I did this and then we've done it occasionally since is um, go to Pinterest and then I find like a Disney bracket of like a bunch of movies and then um, you know we watch them and then they choose and we figure out which one's the favorite so that's what they're doing they would not normally choose Oliver and Company otherwise but um this was the next one on the dizzy bracket. So that's, I'm gonna actually bring you down just a little bit. Okay, there we go. Um, so that's the, that's the background noise today for anyone that was wondering. So, and it's crazy because next, well, I guess they'll be here next Friday. I was gonna say next Friday's first day of school, but it's only a half day. So they'll still be, <laughs> they'll still be around for next, Friday's filming but the following Friday I'll just have my four-year-old and most likely she'll just have headphones and her iPad to do ABC Mouse or watch a movie depending on what we do on that Friday so um, it's kind of crazy I just can't believe we're back into um, the school year So I'm not going to do the bottom washi because actually I think I know what I'm going to do this week for the theme, like, but because I have so many options and I ended up switching last week, I decided to wait the bottom washi until I do a little bit of decorating. So I'm either going to do, um, the, there's a bunch of these little butterflies that I really like, or we're going to do the sunflowers, mainly for the butterflies. So, um, in that case, we'll probably do this one anyway, but we're going to hold off. So let me get boxes out because we have a couple things we need to mark. So like I said, I have Rapatha on Monday. Let me grab, I do the um, calendar weeks sticker kit um, and I use that in my health planner. Um, but I don't use a lot of the functional stuff, so I can use it over here. So I'm thinking about doing the, remind, what color do I want to do? Um, I guess it doesn't matter. All the butterflies are different colors. Let's just go with this green. So let's do the reminder here and then we'll just write it. Oh, that's crooked. And we'll write in the Rapatha. There. Okay, and then the next thing would be sneak a peek night on the 9th. Let's see. I have a feeling that this week is going to get busy for me. I could be wrong, but I'm waiting for some test results back and then potentially then a telehealth visit, and that could very well happen this week. We'll see. It might not happen until the following week, which is busy in its own right because I have a doctor's appointment, my birthday. Um, so let's mark sneak a peek night. How do I want to mark sneak a peek night? Let's go with the, let's move that out of the way. Let's go with this. Oh, here it is. I was like, what do I do with it? This purple box and put it right here. 
You know what I didn't do? I did not write down, I did not put my second. Let's go ahead and put this line where I put my dots just because I like the look of it. Um, I'm looking forward to the next year. If you missed it, I went ahead and pre-ordered the Sterling Ink Week Size. And she's got grid on this side and I'm really looking forward to that. So, um, anyway, so that's for sneak a peek night. I feel like we need a bigger box for, for the first day of school. Even though it's a half day, it's still like a significant event, you know? Like that's kind of the thing of the day. I don't really want to use this big because I do need my checklist over here. So, let's see. I mean, I could do one of these. I wish there was a green of those. Hmm. <laughs> I could do this green on the right day and just do back to school. Or I could do a yellow or like this orange. Like a back to school. I don't know what I want to do. You know what? I'm going to grab out. Before I put this down. <clears throat> put that on my hand. I'm going to grab out my die cuts and see if there's anything I want to use here. Not that I want to keep using the die cuts, but I don't know. The fairy is really big. She might be better in my journal. I talked about doing butterflies and I do have like this butterfly sheet, but I don't know that I want to do, I don't know what I want to do. I don't know. I don't want to, I don't think I want to use die cuts just because they are so much thicker. Um, so let's just, let's just, not with that. I was thinking about if I put this here because there's a butterfly in this one and then I can put these little butterflies just around the page and then I can pull my colors after that. It's like I like to put down the functional stuff first because that's really what's the most important but sometimes it's hard because when you have like a kit like this that has so many different colors um trying to figure out um Trying to, trying to figure out what colors you want to use, you know. I have ants still on my desk. It's driving me nuts. Um, let's put this down here. On... Oh. No, there's one on my leg. It's driving me nuts. Let's go ahead and just do this one. Let's just commit. Let's just commit to it and I'm going to use it all the way across. Um, and then I'll just, you know, make it work. Sometimes if I cover my line like that, what I do is I literally just kind of right here. I don't have a dot, but I, I just put a little X. I, it doesn't have to be perfect, right? Like <laughs> doesn't have to be perfect. Okay. I am like all over the place. <laughs> I don't know what, what my deal is today. Um, it's been a long week, honestly. That's that's part of my deal, I think, because that's not all the work. Dang it. Um, it's just, I thought we were never going to get to Friday. My youngest is beyond ready for my two oldest to go back to school. Um, she's been a little bit of a nightmare this week. I love her to pieces, but the strong willness of this child will be my undoing. I I love her, but she's a lot. So that's been a little bit less than ideal this week. It's finally though about to cool back down a little bit. And by cool back down, it's like 80s, which is fine because we've been in like the 100s and upper 90s and it's way too hot, way too hot. <laughs> um, So I'm just going to kind of put these butterflies about, I think. No real rhyme or reason.
season. I have another kind of smaller size one that I haven't used. Um, sorry, I'm looking at my other sheets. Here's a white one that I could use. Um, so let's actually move this one, I think, if I can, a little, a little bit higher. Oh, I shook my camera. Everything is shaking. I had to take a break and I have no idea what I was talking about. Um, they finished all over and I started the next one and then they were immediately bored of it. So we had to find something else. Uh, so they're watching Scooby-Doo. My kids are a big fan of Scooby-Doo. Um, okay, so I think I'm done with the decorating. Actually, what did I do? Here it is. I was thinking about putting, let's see what it looks like. I could put this up at the top just for kicks and giggles. Uh. Oops. Well, this is going swimmingly. Let's see. Let's go with it. Why not? Let's just keep on with the chaos. I may change my mind, but for now, I'm going to keep it. Okay. So I think that part of it is done. So let's kind of write in some things. Sneak a peek is like, we go up, it's because school doesn't start till 11th, but you go up, you see, you go to your classroom, you take all your school supplies so you don't have to carry it all on the first day, meet your teacher, get all your stuff, you know, all that. So you kind of learn where everything is. So that's sneak a peek night. Um, and then, oops, go back to school. day. So I will, I mean, I'll set an alarm for when I need to pick up, but bummer. I was actually going to write first day of school, but for some reason I wrote back to school. So there's that. Okay. So let's see. Um, let's put a couple things that I need to move over here. Brainstorm. September. some releases in September that I need to figure out for the shop. Um, I need to update all the fall listings. Um, I'm still kind of playing around with the idea of doing some mini sheets. I will keep that on my list until I decide one way or the other. Um, and then let's see, I'm still working on a story idea. Jones. I gotta get to that. I really need to get to that this week. Clean shelves. There we go. Mm, I gotta finish my edits on um, my last chapter of the book I wrote. I think that's all I can think of right now. Um, just FYI, um, because I did not share this when I did a setup. So back here I have um, my tracker. This top section is watering plants, which I should do today. Um, these are the names of my plants, because <laughs> um, we named them all. And then here's just some miscellaneous things. But I also have started um, back a little farther. Also, this is how this is. Um, the goals are coming together. It's good having it back there, a little bit more room. Um, I also started um, a cleaning tracker. So I have a summer cleaning checklist, which 
I just now started it, so we'll see how far I can actually get with August and September, because this is what, this will happen for August and September. And then I started a tracker for this. So this first section is my daily stuff I wanna do daily. This is weekly stuff. This is bi-weekly stuff. So, you know, every other week. Um, and then this is monthly stuff. So we'll see how this works out. And if it works out, then we'll do another one for September. I started a list of ideas for extra chores so my kids can earn some money. And then, you know, so on and so forth. So we'll see. Um, I'm just hoping that this helps kind of keep me on track a little bit more like, hey, I need a vacuum. I didn't vacuum before, you know, that kind of thing. So we'll see. Um, that was just a side note. Um, but I think this is it. I do need to, um, I will need to edit this plan with me and then I'll need to edit, um, Thursday's video is an uh, update on my travel journal. So I'll need to edit that video and then I'll have, I need to film on Friday. So I guess we can write that down too. So film plan with me, which is Friday. And I'm not sure what my other video is going to be for next week. I thought about, which by the way, I've officially been on YouTube for a year. Yay. Um, I thought about actually doing another day in the life because I think I did that around my birthday last year. Um, so maybe a day in the life, it might be a recipe plan with me. I'm not sure yet. Um, I have a couple ideas of some other videos that I want to bring to the shop, bring to the shop, bring to the channel. Um, some that I've done before that I just, you know, haven't done one in a while, like a recipe plan with me or, you know, setting up my meal planner and just a memory plan with me, you know, things like that. Um, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure what it's going to be yet. So if you have like something you really want to see, let me know. Um, and yeah, but I think this is it. I think, um, I think it'll, it's cute. I always like it once it gets more filled in, you know, it always kind of takes on a life of its own. Um, but yeah, this is what I have. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.